Dave, I need to talk to you. Okay, what's up? As you know, there have been a lot of layoffs here on the island recently. Yes, it has been a little crazy here. In a manager's meeting this morning we discovered that you are the last non-management employee. This presents a problem when the other 900 managers start to question what you actually do and why we keep you around. Since you are on my budget and no one else has an employee, it makes my budget look out of line. Out of line. But, I'm the only worker left, everyone else is management. They spend all day golfing or sailing and call it a meeting. That's what management does, Dave. We are tasked with operating the range and use as much of the budget as possible on meaningless things. You see, Dave, if real work is performed, then we are held accountable to the government. We don't want that. That is where problems come in. If we are in meetings, then we can avoid taking phone calls. If we are in meetings, we cannot reply to emails. And if we are always in meetings, then we must appear to the government as being really busy, and they leave us alone. But, but... But since you are non-management, you stick out like a sore thumb. Dave... I have to let you go. Friday will be your last full day of employment. And since you are the last worker, it will be up to you to process your own PCS and take care of your own pack out. What? How will you survive without me? We will have a meeting about that tomorrow. Right after we have a meeting where I request that I get 90% of your salary as a bonus for saving the company money. Upper management loves when we make it look like we are saving money on paper. As you know, the government has the use it or lose it policy, so we have to distribute your salary to someone. The remaining 10% will go to Green's fees or something like that. How long do you think you can get away with this? We figure we have another year before the range closes. The generators will run that long before they seize up. The rest of the infrastructure will fail along with it at about the same rate. When the range closes, we will all collect huge bonuses for using up every asset. The island will be worth nothing when we are done. Our run to failure policy will have been a success. The government loves with a plan like that works as designed. Remember Dave, redefining excellence is what we do here. Thank you for your service. So, this is where you track all the stuff in space? Yes, it is we have the most powerful system in the universe. Nothing can escape detection. Well, normally. Normally? Yes. We have been having a hard time tracking anything lately. You heard they laid off Dave, the last worker, didn't you? Yes, I saw Dave packing his things this morning. He was upsetting the budget, being an actual employee. The last non-management employee too. That is correct. He was the last non-management employee. In a meeting we had this morning we were informed that now with Dave gone, there is no one to do the work here. All of us were shocked. Now what do we do? None of the managers are trained to do manual work. My God, we are management, not labor. Amazing. Wasn't this discussed in a meeting before Dave was terminated? It might have been, but my management team was scuba diving. I mean, in a meeting, when that decision was made. There was a heated argument this morning between the golfing managers and the sailing managers as to whose fault it is that Dave was terminated. So what are they doing to do? Well, the Coconut Telegraph says they will try to get the managers in Huntsville to take over Dave's work. Though, I'd heard they eliminated all of their non-management workers in Huntsville months ago to control their budgets. It's a real mess right now. The government is asking questions and demanding answers. Can you believe it? What about Dave's manager? Will they demote him and have him do Dave's work? No way that will ever happen. You see, Dave's manager is friends with the golfing, sailing, scuba diving, drinking, and wife swapping managers, and has dirt on all of them, so they would never demote him. I'm sure they will find someone else to demote, or, maybe, they will have to hire Dave back. That should be easy, he is still at the airport. I need to go now, I have a meeting, and have to fill my scuba tanks first. I've been looking all over for you. Where the hell have you been? At a meeting. Have you seen Dave? I need to find him right away. 
Why? What's going on? Why don't you have your cat suit on? Were you scuba diving? You heard they lay Dave off, didn't you? Yes, he is the end of an era on the island, the last manual laborer. Gone. He was the last real worker on the island. The only one who did manual labor. Everyone who didn't get laid off are all managers. Before they lay Dave off, no one had a meeting to see what he actually did here on the island. Now that he's gone, all hell is breaking loose. Well, he may be over at the vet's hall. He has keys to it, you know, since he's the only bartender we have after the last layoffs. Oh no, if he leaves who will bartend? And he was supposed to put my sailboat back in the water next week. Who will mow the greens? I have OCD, I can't get my hands dirty. Damn, this could be very bad and the effects could ripple across the island. What are you going to do? I am going to find Dave before it's too late. That's what I'm going to do. If anyone is looking for me, tell them I'm in a meeting.